Hey everybody, it's the Dark Comic Nerd playing Fake Grand Order. So, it's been a while, hasn't it? Um, and pardon me guys, I just woke up, so my eyes are killing me right now. Uh, so you're going to see me scratch them a lot. Um, so what happened last time? Well, I said, well, things seemed a little weird. We were doing the end of... Uh, we were heading towards the end of the Caldea Boys, and I re-looked at the calendar, and the calendar said we had one whole week left to go. So we did have a whole week. Um, I would have liked to have spent that time trying to get done um, leading up to the uh, comma event, but I knew I wasn't going to make it. It's really sad that all these new events basically punish you for not having the free time to finish all the Lost Belt stuff. It's like, why can't you just be satisfied, game and game designers, with the fact that we maybe finished the first Lost Belt? You always have to finish the newest third one to do any of them. So this is going to be much like the Sparrow in one, where we just won't be able to do the event, but we can roll for the characters, and that's what we're going to do this morning. Um, uh, Pavardi, or I, I'm probably saying that wrong, but I'm just going to say that uh and comma we can roll for either one of those and either one would be great to have comma is the one that everybody wants this season pretty much everybody's going crazy over getting her so we're gonna try that we have enough summon tickets to uh kiddushan ritual this morning we're gonna try for it the update just happened last night um and i'm gonna go for it this morning just to see what happens, because everybody's gone gung-ho for this character, and I'd like to take my chances and see what happens. Much like I did with, um, uh, who was it? Uh, Scotty. Now, Scotty, I didn't get, I didn't get her. Um, and the thing is, is that I really didn't have, well, actually, I probably used more quartz than I currently have right now. Now, they're giving quartz away like candy right now. They're giving away for everything, um... They really are. If you haven't logged on, I'm sure if you... Well, you could be watching this before you've logged on. If you haven't logged on, log on. You'll be getting tons of quartz. They're just giving it away left and right here. So, I got plenty of it already. But now I even have more of it. So, we got enough to do, um, I think, a Kitoshan ritual. And then maybe I'll do one of my own usual rituals with a double or triple this morning. See what happens. If we don't get anything with the Kitoshan ritual right off the bat. Really... I probably don't super care about this whole event. Uh, the event is just going to be one of these things where I'm going to have to wait till it repeats next year. And hopefully by then I'll have completed more of what I need. But in the meantime, I just can't do anything in the event. But I can still roll for the characters, which that's personally good enough for me. I don't really care about the event. I don't have time for a lot of these. I work for a living. I start could attest to that. Sometimes, folks... We can't, um, some of us out there, we can't attribute our entire life to playing this game. I'm sorry that the game designers seem to think we can, but just ain't going to happen. So what we're going to do is we're going to kick it off, and I don't have, like I said, a lot of time this morning, but I wanted to try this right after the, th the thing updated, and uh, it was updating until like 2 in the morning last night. So here it is. It's just a little bit before 10. Um, and we're going to go for it. We're going to do a couple rolls this morning and see what our our chances are. See what we got and then see what ends up happening. Uh, do we get it? Do we not? And do we have to do more later on tonight or later on down the road? Because this event's going on, I think, for a while, to say it mildly. But just one last iteration, guys. One last thing. When I mentioned in the Caldea Boys that I said, okay, the next video... It would be there in a few days or a week. I think it's obvious to everybody that <laughs> it ended up being a whole week. So it's been a while, guys. So hopefully cross your fingers and we'll have some good luck here, guys. Let's keep in mind that any... Um, any, uh, what am I thinking, of craft essences we get that are for the event, they won't be useful. Maybe next year they will be, though, or they'll just be useful for what they do uh, for their abilities outside the event. Ah, archers are coming this morning. 
Now we're looking for, I believe, a Lancer and an Assassin, if I'm not mistaken. I know with Kama, we're definitely looking for an Assassin. Um, her character is interesting, if I recall. I think she starts off at the beginning as you ascend her as this little girl. And the character actually matures to a different character by the time you fully ascended her. It's, uh, it's sort of one of those characters that I believe is doing that. They're now doing that more often. Because I think there's another character out there in the Japanese one that does the same thing. I don't remember the name though. So far, we're not getting a whole lot of anything good. Uh, it might be a bad... I want to say that during the Scotty thing, they seem to be really nerfing the rates. And I wonder if they're going to do it here too, but we'll find out. Well, it's a Lancer. And it's not the Lancer we need. Um, I'm trying to think. Uh, let's see. Are we down... I think we are, uh, yeah, if I'm not mistaken, I think we're down to, we've used it, 11, 10, 9, 8, and 7. So we are down, folks. Let's go for it. Come on, Kitashan Ritual, let's see if you make out, or does my ritual make out? Or maybe both get us a little bit of something of each. Maybe one will get us our four star, and one will get our five star. Uh, no crackle there, so it's nice to at least see Lancers because I'm pretty sure that sh uh, one of the cards is a Lancer. So at least we're hitting some of the same class. <clears throat> oh, there's an event card. I probably will never see one because I can't play the event where a lot of times these three stars are just given to you. So, that's a good thing for me. There's an assassin. Alright. <clears throat> like I said, my worst problem this morning is time. I don't really have a lot of time to do this. Ooh, did we get her? Did we get party? Yes! Woo! There's one character I don't have. Thank you, Kitashan Ritual, apparently. Remember the last one we did, guys? Two far, or I think one of the last good ones we did, two five stars in a row. Oh, man. It'd be nice to have one of those mornings. A four star and then a five star. Ooh, five star craft essence. Not a bad one either, but. Four star. Nice. We got a nice rounded, um, we got a nice rounded thing of, uh, Three star, four star. We got a nice uh, rounded assortment of craft essences from the event. And uh, some good servants this morning, too. Konnichiwa. <laughs> <laughs> Now, I did her trial quest. Um, she's a fairly good character, but a lot of people don't really hype a lot of stuff about her. So let's see what these cards do, guys. Firefighter Spirit. Increase your Buster card. Effectiveness by 3% and NP gain by 5%. And these would be good for Snowy Face Powder during the event. We won't be doing that. And our other one, increase, uh, so let's see, Spring Beauty, increase NP gain by 15%, and critical strength by 15% for yourself. Increase amount of Lunar Luster r Rouge dropped. Well, we won't be doing that either. Which character is that supposed to be? 
No, nah, they don't say. It's too bad. I'd like to know who the who the character's supposed to be that they're basing the card on. And then here's her. <clears throat> Increase quick card effectiveness and NP game, which isn't too bad. Uh, imaginary around EX. Okay, what an interesting name for that. And she's got a core of the goddess. And there's a whole bunch of other stuff. And she would have been helpful in the event by... It, she would have been one of those lucky special characters that we would have been able to get a attack increase during the event. Uh, that won't be happening, unfortunately. So, here's a Noble Phantasm. Deal heavy damage to all enemies. Dealing it to all enemies is just awesome. Medium chance to inflict charm to all enemies and increase NP gauge for all allies. What a nice Noble Phantasm. I like that. I'll let you guys look at this. Uh, we'll keep it there in case you guys want to pause it and look at it later. I'm not going to read it off. Her Noble Phantasm is an EX, and I agree with that big time. And let's look at the character skin. And there we go. And like I said, I used her during one of the trial things, and she did pretty dang good. And I like the card. So I'm, I'm good with that. Uh, I enjoyed what I got out of that. Let's just put it that way. Now, time is my enemy. It's almost 10 o'clock. I still need to shower and get a bit more fuller breakfast in me before I go to work in half an hour. But we are going to try, and I emphasize we are going to try, um, to actually do one of mine and see if we can get a comma so that maybe we can get this all over and done with. Now, um... There is some other, uh, I think there's um, some other servants that are going to be part of this that I would maybe like to take my chances and go after too. And as everybody knows, they gave everybody money hand over fist. We talked about this a couple weeks ago, how I would have a lot of money. I still do. So I can put some more money into this, but I am not going down the Scotty Road again where it will just be ridiculous amounts of money. And I will see Diddly Squat coming back for my... Um, well, let's just put it this way. Me want money going in to equal amount of goodies coming out. <laughs> yeah. And I know that a lot of this is gambling, basically, but, yeah. I'm looking for, we just got, why am I, did I have it in the, I do, I have it in the reverse order. Um, we have a few level ones here, though. Um, we still got some stuff from previously, and I've got, I've got these blaze of wisdoms coming out my butt. So we're gonna see if we can get we can get a super. So we're gonna see if we can get a double or triple right off. Um, I usually have good luck with the characters that are just starting off. Not always, but. She's one of those extra cheery characters, and then when she gets mad, everybody run for the hills. It's the kind of character they make her into. We're going to see if we can level her up right now. <laughs> I was going to save a lot of those Blaze of Wisdoms for the next time there was a um, increased double or triple chance event, but... Keep in mind, guys, that I believe there's um, kind of like a chance of diminishing returns. Um, and in this case, what I mean by that is I believe personally that every time you do this, um, you take a greater chance of down the road here at some point, you will get what you want. That eventually they will give you a... Um, we're going to go back to singles here for a bit. They will give you a double or triple at some point. That the chances every time you do it are slightly increased. Yeah, like I said, we've got enough to just keep blowing it. But we're going to switch to craft essences for time purposes if we have to. <clears throat> Actually, let's use up some of our Lancers down here that we got that we don't really need. And one of those. <clears throat> we almost got her heading up to her first Ascension stage already.
Looks like they're not biting this morning, though. It looks like we're going to have a hard time getting a double or triple. And I was afraid of that. And it's the time. I, I hope I'm not boring you guys any. I think we did pretty good. But for me, it's time. I need to be able to do a few things, and I don't have the time to be goofing off with this thing. Um, being stingy this morning. Okay. We're going to take a shot. If I can. Okay, we're going to just boom, boom, boom. Go for three. And then we're going to go to craft distances next if this doesn't work. Yeah, they really don't want to give it to us in the servants this morning, apparently. Okay. Uh, we want to close. Because, like I said, it's time. It's timing that's a problem this morning. Okay, this is going to take me just a little bit, guys. Um, I don't have as many craft distances to spare as I used to in the good old days. Um, there are some uh, little things, though, that I still have to do. I still have some limit breaks and some other stuff that I still have left. So we're going to... Uh, I've been saving them just for this occasion so that we can use them to get maybe a double. Okay, no hits there. <clears throat> Here's from a while ago where we had this thing going on uh, during one of the events. I think we can... Yeah, yep, yeah, yeah, yeah. There's no reason we can't limit break that card. We're going to do it one at a time, though, if we can. Did you... No, there we go. What I am going to do, guys, is because of lack of time, and we haven't done it in a while, and I'd like to see, I always like to see how my rituals stack up against Kitashans, but if we can't get anything off a few of these, um, we are going to go for it no matter what. We're just going to go for it. <clears throat> and luck of the draw, thank you. That's why I think it works better in craft distances than it does servants. Just because the game design seems like it doesn't want to give it to us during Servants. Because, oh, we don't want you getting those extra... We don't want you getting that extra little bit of experience because then it will take you longer and you might not want to buy stuff from us. Ugh. Well, there's something good right off the bat. Four-star craft essence. Um, don't know if that's going to go badly for us down the line, but remember, folks... Um, we, uh, really can afford to do this later, too. This is going to be my last one this morning, guys, and then we might pick up another one later if we have to. Um, we're going to have to wait and see how things work out. Hey, there we go, another four-star. No, there's a little thinking going on with the server this morning. Did it benefit us? No, not unless they're going to spook us. Nope. Yeah, no. Nothing there. But, uh, yeah, I uh, really think that uh, this common thing, unless she just pops up here and I end up staying, I, unless I have to basically eat my own words, I think it's going to be hard to come by her because... If the Scotty event taught me anything, I think that the, I think that a lot of people are right, and when they say that the chances are rated up, and they show you the statistics on them, I really feel like they sometimes know that people, based on watching people talk about it on YouTube and stuff, they know these characters are highly sought after, and they actually spoof the rates a little bit. They don't say they do, but I think they do. Just based on experience and some stuff I've seen. Wow, not a whole lot this morning on that one. My ritual did not even get us much for servants. Um, but we did get two 
uh, craft distances. So, in both four stars, so not bad. But wait, there's more! We're gonna do a surprise final roll, guys. So, since you had to put up with me doing all that work to do the double, um, we're gonna do one right off the cuff. No frills, no nothing. See what happens, and that will be the last one. And then we're gonna finish up in just a moment because we can afford to do this. So, let's one. No rituals, no nothing, guys. Let's see what we come up with. <laughs> A lot of times these tend to get you nothing good. Maybe like one four star craft essence, but I mean, that's only because you're guaranteed something of a four star, a servant, a craft essence during these rolls, but. Do, 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 do. Let's see what we end up with, guys. A lot of really lackluster three star craft essences so far. <clears throat> Ooh, saving the best for last, and I use that loosely. Because you don't know what you're going to get, but so far it's been nothing but three stars. And there it is. There's our four star. Oh, I see some thinking going on. What are we going to get? Really had to think just to give us a servant. Just to give us a three-star servant. I saw you take that extra time to think. Not even an assassin class character in this one. At least if I'm not mistaken, I didn't see one yet. And there she be, guys. Not much for servants. Not much for anything good. Hence the reason why, if anybody's ever wondered why a lot of us, as far as the players and the YouTubers, do these rituals, that's why. Because doing regular rolls without a little bit of extra pizzazz in the front of it doesn't seem to net you a whole lot. So, um, kind of diminishing return here, though, this morning, guys. We ended up starting off with some good uh, gold cards, uh, five-star craft essence, uh, four-star craft essence, a four-star servant, and then as we kept doing each roll, it just kept getting less and less. But that does not matter to us. What we are going to do is we are going to leave it here, guys. I hope the fact that we got uh, Pavardi or Pavadi, um, not ever probably going to pronounce that name right. It's a Indian name, and um, you have to pronounce it with just the right accent, in my opinion, to get it right. I don't think I'm ever going to be able to get it right, but we did get her. And we did get some really cool stuff this morning, all things considered. So if you guys like the fact that we did that, hey, leave a like. If you want to leave a comment, that would be awesome too. And in the meantime, I am going to try to quickly get ready. I now have 20 whole minutes. I think I can start making my breakfast because it's just something I got to throw in the microwave pretty much. And at the same time, go jump, jump in my shower and still have plenty of time. So I want to say that I enjoyed my time with you guys this morning. I hope you enjoyed uh, your time here too. Hope you guys that are rolling have great luck. Much better luck. I'll be looking forward to seeing how some people do. And uh, I'm going to be back, I think, later tonight as it starts off my night of... Uh, well, basically I have to go see Chunky Jeffrey tonight, guys. And then I will be back at home. And then I'm basically starting off my roll into my day off tomorrow. It's going to be Noah's Flood practically for the next couple days around here. We are supposed to be in for almost five days straight of rain. Nothing but rain. So it's going to be uh, building up tomorrow. It's going to be very blah. It's not going to be a nice sunny day it is now. So the thing is, is that um, I'm probably going to take the time tonight to do that. If not, I will take some of the blah day tomorrow to see if maybe we can bring a little light to the old, uh, the game here, whereby we won't have any beautiful sunlight outside. 
Uh, also, I would like to point out real quick before I leave, guys, that if you have not had the chance, please go over to my Dark Comic Nerd channel. Check out how the room here is going, guys, because I am redoing my gaming slash living room. And I did a video last night to show how it's going. So if you have not had a chance to check that out, please go over and check that out, guys, and see how I'm doing. And if possible, leave a comment uh, about what you guys think about the progress so far. In the meantime, guys, though, this is the Dark Comic Nerd. I am signing off. You have a terrific Tuesday, and we will see you later.